Hey guys and welcome to another video. Today's video is a track guide around my favourite fantasy circuit, Magyar. If you want to see more track guides, please go over to the channel and check them out, there's a playlist full of them. And make sure you hit that subscribe button as there'll be plenty more. Let's stop with the introduction and get to the video. As we come down the start finish straight, we're going to break just a car's length off the 100 meter board. This is not so much that we mess up turn one, but it sets us up perfectly with a much, much tighter turn two. Keep it nice and tight through turn two. I like to go up on the yellow stuff and then straighten up so you can get the power down as quickly as possible coming out the corner. As you come through turn three, you want to make sure you don't stray too far for the right, otherwise that will compromise your entrance into turn four and hamper you the whole way down the straight. Abuse the track limits here and get on the power really, really early so you can power down this long straight looking for your next braking zone. My next braking zone is the very end of the grey bit on the left. You want to hang it out to dry on the left then cut in, hitting the rumble strip on the way through. Now do not be tempted to turn in too early, otherwise you'll find yourself get the apex wrong and you'll be in the grass. As we're making our way up the hill, I'm looking for the tyre marks on the rumble strip just ahead of us. That's my breaking point. Turn in and then you'll see we're going to try and straight line this next section of corners as much as possible. And we're going to be full throttle the whole way. We've made it through the trickiest part now and we're going to continue to straight line these curves. As we come over the crest of the hill, we're starting to look for our breaking point, which is in between the black screen on the left and the 50 metre mark. Brake hard, turn in, this is your apex. To be honest, I could be a bit tighter. Corner will then spit you out and you can get yourself on the power as soon as possible up the hill. Straight line the next two corners as much as you can. Our next breaking point here is going to be about the 60 metre mark. Come in, go over the kerb on the inside, run it wide and position your car and calculate your turn in to straight line these two corners here. Going on the dust and the rumble strip here is advantageous. Coming into the final corner is those tyre marks on the rumble strip. Then it's very, very important to get off the brakes and get your nose into the corner. Get yourself back on the power for the run down to the start finish line, for which should be a decent time. And we managed to log a 204.6, only 1.2 off the leaderboard, so that's not bad considering it was only three laps of work. So guys, that's the end of the video. I hope this video has helped you out. Let me know if it has in the comment section below. Be sure to like the video and check out the rest of the playlist for all my track guides in the series. And also don't forget to subscribe. So until next time guys, cheers.